The guy on the pole today is Rich Bickle. It's his first pole ever in the Craftsman NASCAR Truck Series, and uh, he's done it in a Petty Enterprises Dodge. As far as Eddie Petty Enterprises is concerned, it's their first pole since winning one back at Bristol in August of 79 with the King behind the wheel. Now for Dodge, they get to celebrate here in Portland today with the King and Rich Bickle because it's their first pole ever. Fifth Daytona pole for Elliott. 164th time that a Dodge has started first in the Winston Cup race, but the first time since 1978. Bill Pam and there's yeah, the that's man that will Bill lead them down there. to the green flag a week from tomorrow. It's his 50th career pole position, fourth in this race, and fifth at the track. today. He will have led 93 of 160 laps. Now he's one quarter away from an Indianapolis winner's trophy. Dale Earnhardt, Dale Jarrett, Jeff Gordon, and now Bill Elliott joins the list of winners of the Brickyard 400 at Indy. Last two weeks have been awesome for me. I'm still uh, tingling. I can't hardly believe it. First win for Dodge. Uh, Pinzo, I'll tell you, this is, this is unreal. I'm going to be reeling for a week. You got any idea what uh, what all this pays you today? You get a new truck, you get winning, you get a, a bonus from Dodge. There's a huge trophy for you over there. A lot of stuff for that first Dodge victory. It sure does. It, it pays a lot more than that first half of that race, let me tell you. I uh, <laughs> got a little upset there. I run a little hard, and the uh, truck was a little better in the first half than it was the second half. I think I uh, earned my keep there in the second half, but... This is a heck of a lot of fun, and uh, I don't know. I don't know if it get much better than this, but we're going to try. Well, congratulations again to Tony Raines. Earnhardt doesn't know what to do. He's got Gordon on one side. Here comes this crowd down the other side here. He said, well, got to go to the left, or to the left here and move these guys out of the way. And that did it. Jerry Nadeau really gives Sterling the boost up off of turn three that got him down there and passed Dale Earnhardt. He really did. So Dodge wins a race, guys. Sterling Marlin will go to victory lane. Now in his eighth try at the Great American Race, it's going to be Ward Burton driving his Dodge to victory lane. On, Checker flag on. is up, and Ward Burton is going to win the 44th Daytona 500. <laughs> Hamilton comes across the start-finish line as your 2,000 champion. Man, it's all about them right there, I swear. Just put the camera on them. I told you this wasn't that big of a deal for me. Uh, this is huge. It is the first NASCAR championship for Penske Racing, the first Dodge driver to win a nationwide series championship. And when we come back, we've got a lot of celebrating to do. He didn't know what it would feel like to be a champion. Well, he's going to know now. Paul Wolf paired together with Brad a couple of years ago, winning the NASCAR Nationwide Championship, one of the bright minds in the sport, considered by many to be a dynamic duo, these two. Now, I'm not sure this isn't just a start. We don't want to overlook this first one, but this is a team that keep this together. A lot of good people involved there that can certainly make a difference. How about Dodge? going out and they get the championship leaving the sport right now.